everyone. This is Yasuko and it's time for Massage Monday. It takes two to make the massage experience great. Last week, I talked about how to be a good massage giver. This week, I'm going to talk about how to be a good massage receiver. So number one, communicate clearly. Be specific about the pressure you want using pain scale of 1 to 10 if necessary. And be specific about the location using right, left, up or down. Your specific request will help you get what you want. I know someone who tries to communicate with big size like <sighs> during massage, but unless you know the massage giver is a psychic, please use words. And be nice as you give your directions. It really helps to use the word please. Especially if you're getting a free massage from your partner at home. They're doing you a favor, so be nice. Number two, motivate the giver. If something feels good, let them know so. Use the positive reinforcement to make the giver want to give you more. If you're asked how it is and you just say, okay, it kind of deflates the motivation of the giver to do more. You don't have to lie, but if something feels good, tell them so with a little bit of exaggeration. Use the positive reinforcement before you make a specific request too. For example, oh, that feels good. Now can you please try that a little bit to the right? And don't forget to thank the giver at the end of the massage. Number three, be a big flat noodle. Receiving is a gift to the giver. So when you receive massage, just be a big flat noodle and completely relax. Don't try to help the giver. Often when I massage hands, people give me their fingers for me to massage, but it's actually harder to massage when the fingers are stiff. So just relax and enjoy receiving. To recap on how to be a good massage receiver, communicate clearly, motivate the giver, and be a big flat noodle. Of course, the massage giver needs to create the environment for the receiver to do this. So be a good massage giver and be a good massage receiver to enhance your massage experience. Thanks for watching. I'll see you back next week. Make it a great week and Happy New Year.